This video is dedicated to those PlayStation fanboys who are always hating on the Xbox One. Uh, now I don't know how you can defend yourself and blame it on the Xbox One and how the PS4 is superior. Because according to this uh, PS4 user, he posted this on YouTube, the link will be in the description. He bought some games digitally on the PlayStation Store. He legally bought it and when he tried to play it without internet connection, it did not allow him to play the game. And it said, cannot load application, has to connect to internet to verify license. And he did this for many different games and they all did the same thing when, they, when he got it digitally. So then he also went to Twitter to find out maybe there's some problem with the PS4 or something and he doesn't know, whatever. So he tweets out to Yoshida about this DRM stuff. And then he finds out that Yoshida says that the PlayStation has DRM on digital games since 06. And most people don't know that and they never really talked about it, they kind of hid it away. So it might be true but most people don't know that and that's really bad you need to outline and tell everybody what's going on like Microsoft at E3 even though you may not like all the DRM and some of the policies about it were really bad at least they told us and we could fight back and get rid of the stuff we don't want see Sony we can't get rid of the DRM because we never knew about it they've been lying to us about this whole time um, you and me, I don't currently don't have a PS4. I'll be picking on one later. But I'd be really mad if I bought a PS4 and got all my games digitally and then my Wi Fi goes out or something like that. I can't play any of my games because Sony never told me that there's DRM. Um, so just leave me in the comment system below on what you think about all this DRM stuff from the PlayStation 4 and if you have your own experience with this too. And make sure you hit the like button, subscribe button to help on my channel. And I'll see you next time.